back to my channel. My name is Ruby. If you're new to my channel, please tap and subscribe down below. So for today's video, I have a huge Amazon buys slash must haves. So some of these things, I haven't even tried them, but I saw them on TikTok and I thought I would try it. And uh, yeah, and the reason why a lot of these things are still brand new is because I am trying to move out soon and I want to take these things to that new place. So I started buying things early. That way, you know, when I move out, I already have them instead of having to buy them. Plus, you know, everything else. So I went ahead and bought these things. I will kind of categorize it by beauty restroom, kitchen, and travel. And so I will go ahead and start with beauty things. And the first thing I wanna show you guys is this makeup brush cleanser. And so I ordered this and honestly, I already tried it. And I'm not the happiest with it. I don't think it was for me. I didn't really like it. Now I see a lot of girls did like it. So just because I didn't like it doesn't mean you won't like it. So this is a makeup brush cleaner. Cleanser. So what you do is just put some water right here and a little bit of um, either cleanser like for your brushes. And it comes with this little tool right here. And so what you do is and they have these little measuring thingies so this right here just measures like the the size of the brush so if you have a thick brush you, you'll you'll use this one and if you have a tiny brush you know you'll use the smallest hole that way you can put your little brush right there and it will hold it steady and then it has another size a little square that little square goes into this little tool right here you put it right here and then you put your brush right here and then it has an on button that's it easy enough and then when you have the brush, you just, and the water and everything else, you just press the button, it'll start spinning. And then once you feel like it's clean, you stop it and you remove the brush and it cleans your brushes. Now, I don't like it because it takes too long. And two, I feel like when I put the water, it runs out really quickly or either I put too much soap and it makes too much, you know, too much bubbles. And so for that reason, I don't really like this one. I probably will give it another try, but I'm not sure I'm going to like it. Uh, I did see that on TikTok, because everything that I've been buying, it's from TikTok. And uh, I saw that there was this little, like, uh, like a mat, like a little mat. And all you do is, like, scrub your little brush in, in that little mat, and it cleanses your brush. So I want to try that one because that one seems like it would be way faster than doing this. Especially if you have a lot of brushes. I don't think this one is really good. I'm not sure. I don't. I didn't really like it. Like I will still link it down below. That way if you guys want to try. Like I said, a lot of people did like it. So just because I don't like it doesn't mean that you won't. But it was only like $15. I'm not sure. I will link it down below. That way if you guys want to try it, you know, you guys can go ahead and try it. But this is the first thing I have. The second beauty thing I have is this blackhead remover with LED screen. Now, I haven't tried this one at all. But it says it exfoliates skin, smooths and rejuvenates skin, tightens and lifts loose skin, reduces fine lines, and effecti effectively removes blackheads, dirt, excess oil, and unclog pores and yeah so I got this one and it's a white with pink let me go ahead and open it for you guys I'm excited to try this one honestly the reason why I haven't tried this at all is because one I've been lazy but two is because like I said I want to take this stuff to my brand new place I'm weird like that but it comes with the little tool right here all it has is a the button cleans mode so you you put what kind of like if you want soft, normal, or strong. Um, and then it comes with different little, I don't know what these are called, but like little sizing thing. I'm guessing these are, you know, if you have a your nose little section where you can't, you know, it's tiny. I'm not sure, but I haven't tried it yet, like I said. So I can't wait to try this. Um, if I try it before 
I edit this video. I will insert a clip right now of me trying to try it, if it's a fail or a must have. So I will go ahead and do that maybe for this video. If I don't do it for this video, I'll do another, like a part two to this and do a try on for everything I just got. But this is the second thing I got. I'm so excited to try this because, you know, I'm getting old and I want to make sure my skin is taken care of now sooner than later. So that's the second thing I got. The third thing I got is just this face roller. And I freaking love this. One, because it's pink. Two, is because... You put this in the refrigerator the day before or the night before or in the freezer for like 15 minutes before you try to use it and it has two different sizes, the smaller one and the big one. The big one's more for like the whole face and the smaller one is for the little spots that you can't really put the big one. So I like this to put your face oils, things like that, lotion, um, it helps with the puffness of your skin especially when you wake up and you know you wake up swollen, things like that. It's good to use it and then you can put your lotion, your makeup, things like that. But I also love it because I do tend to have a lot of migraines, a lot of headaches. And so when this is cold, it helps so much. So I'll like massage like the temples and like the head and then my eyes because I get my headaches through my eyes too. Like they start hurting. So I like this super one to be like super cold and then I'll start massaging. So I really, really like this one. This one really works for me. Now, the only thing I do do is every time I put it in the freezer and I need to use it afterward, uh, right after I put it in the freezer, I make sure to grab a makeup wipe and clean it on both sides because you, I touch it a lot. I, I can already see that I touch it a lot. So I don't want to just put it in the freezer and then bring it back and then put it in my face. Like, I feel like, no, that'd be dirty. So I make sure I always clean it right after I take it out of the freezer really quick and then I'll just put it in my face with the oils or lotions, things like that. But this is so cute. I love this. And yeah. Okay, so the next thing is a dream brush. Is it Derma? Derma brush. So I haven't used this one at all either, but I'm excited to try it. So it says... It's just a cleanser. So, but it has different tools, I guess you could call it. So it has this big brush, which is meant for your body to cleanse your whole body, which is kind of cool because this is not just a face thing. Like you can use it for your body. This is a little brush for your face. And then it has a little sponge and a little, I don't know what this is called, like a, what is this called? A stone? So that one, you use it for your feet. You just put it right here in your little machine, put the little stone, and then you can do it for your calluses, things like that, for your feet. So I'm kind of excited because you could do it for your whole body, and it's so cool. Especially the feet one because I I feel like I would need this one the most because I'm always on my foot feet, you know, with close toe shoes, things like that. But I'm so excited to try this one. And like I said, I'll link everything down below. That if you guys want to get this, you guys can try it. So, I can't review this right now. Maybe, maybe if I'm not lazy, I can try, try all these things and show you guys how to use it. And if it does work or not. But for now, this is a just a haul. But I got this and it's so freaking cool. I can't wait to try it. And yeah, the next thing I have... It's going to be another feet thing. So this is for your calluses. Now I have, I ordered this one on a blue and I don't like it. So I might give it to Matt. But um, I did try it once and I don't think I did it right. I should have done it like taking a shower, a hot shower. And then that way my feet are soft, things like that. And then do this because I, the first time I don't think I did it right. And also I was kind of scared because I wasn't sure how how much pressure to put things like that and I think now that I know I feel like I would do it better so but it's this callus dry feet remover I'm not sure how calluses I guess um, dead skin remover and all you do is this has a little button right here and you twist it and it turns on and then you just put it on your foot until you feel like it's soft 
I'm not sure how many times you can use it a week. I think like three times, I'm not sure. I threw away the package. This is the one I have. I will, if I like it, I need to give it a try and again. If I like it, I wanna order a pink one, that way I can just give this to Matt. It does come with another, uh, I guess, stone thing, roller thing. And yeah, so that's the one, two, three, four. I don't even know how many, four? Five. That's the fifth thing I got. Okay, the next thing I got, I'm not sure if this is considered more beauty. No, it's, this is not considered beauty at all. But this is for your clothes. And this is a fabric shaver lint remover. And it's so cool because it's so tiny. One is so tiny, it's so little. Look, it's like the size of my hand, like a foam. And what it does is it just removes lint from pretty much anything. Uh, your couches, your clothes, things like that. And all you do is just, it has this little button right here and you press on it and you put it away. That way it's good to go. And when you wanna use it, you just press that button, lift it up and that way your hand can fit in it and you, you can have a good grip. Then you just press the button right here and put it against either your couches, things like that. If you don't have leather couches like I have fabric couches, uh, I tend to have like new throw blankets and when we first moved in we had a red blanket and it left all those little lint balls all around the couch and so I was picking it out by one by one but that was going to take way too long so then I went ahead and ordered this and it worked so good now my couches look brand new and so all you do is just turn it on you press it around your couch and it'll start shaving it and it collects it right here kind of like a little what's it called uh vacuum and it collects it you just throw it away when you're done the little trash and that's it but it isn't it so cute and it's so little i freaking love little things like this now now i never used to buy things like this until tiktok so tiktok made me buy all of these things that you are about to see today but yeah so this one was like i mean, think only like 15 dollars 20 dollars not much so I went ahead and ordered this just because of my couches. My couches needed help, but it's kind of cool that you can use it pretty much on everything. Clothes, jackets, coats. Sometimes the coats have those little itty bitty balls of, you know, lint. And you can use these. Just make sure it says, like on the rules or what's it called, on the precautions. It says don't use it to shave pet hair. People are crazy if they do this. Um, don't use it when you're dressing. So like if you have it on, don't try to use this thing. And then don't press heavily to prevent damage of fabric. And don't use it when it's char charging. So that's it. But it's so cool. I love it. And honestly, I can't wait to order more things. I have a big old list on Amazon already of my wish list kind of thing. Okay, so now I will go towards the restroom so I only got two things for the restroom from Amazon and I ordered this super cute acrylic tissue box and I ordered it from TikTok so if I say TikTok a lot it's because it's TikTok um, I ordered it and the reason why is because my husband has a lot of allergies throughout the year and I hate that little tissue box I hate it it's ugly and it's always all around my house because he will carry it everywhere because you know his allergies and so I went ahead and ordered this so it looks cute so now if he just carries this thing everywhere at least it looks cute where he puts it so yeah it's so freaking cute it wasn't even that expensive at all and it looks really expensive it's up right now because it's kind of dirty because I keep touching it but once you put it down either in your bedroom your restroom or wherever you want to put it it's so freaking cute it looks so elegant and yeah isn't it so cute so yeah so that's the first thing i got for the restroom category i guess the second thing i have is ay, ay, ay. I, I dropped something. is this huge box and what it is it's and Everything is brand new, like I said, so don't mind that. But I ordered this table, what's it called, tub, tray. So for when I take baths, you know, I can have my laptop, a candle, a coffee. I like that it has like different compartments to everything. So you can put a little book, your laptop, 
a plate or cereal or yogurt or whatever you'd like to take while you take a bath and just little compartments right here so you can put like I don't know little napkin I don't know <laughs> but isn't it so freaking cute and it took me a while to get this color because it was always sold out like people like this color and the only reason why that I got this color is because it matches my restroom right now but if later on when I move out it doesn't match I'll just paint it um, so that's the second thing and last thing I got from the restroom category now I will move on to the travel category so the next thing I got is this collapsible straws and I freaking love this so it says FDA approved BPA free and eco-friendly so I got it because I know when I travel out of the country most of the time they don't have straws and so I got these portable straws it has a little clip right here so you can you know carry it as it like kind of like a keychain or just put it in your bag kind of thing and I got them on a rose gold pink like a pink color and it comes in a little tube we just unscrew it and you get your straw and it's a metal straw and it looks tiny but then you can just make it big like this so it is freaking huge it's like a 12 inch maybe and then it comes with we're gonna leave the little brush The little brush okay so and then it comes with the little brush that way when you're done you can just clean it and put it back in your little thing now I got two of these and I really like them but I did see another TikTok right after I bought these that they have these plasticky ones and girls I guess that order a lot of these straws that they said that this one is really hard to clean now I haven't tried it so I can't tell you like it is or it's not but she did mention another type of straws that are like plasticky, like bendable. And she said that those are cool because like when you get them like this, it breaks apart half, like, like, like it has a line right here throughout the middle. And then so you can open it up, wash it, and then you can just clip it back, which is kind of crazy. Like, I don't know how, how it works. Like, I don't know how water doesn't come out, but... I want to try those too because they look cool and it doesn't hurt to try because I like drinking with straws like I don't like drinking without the straw so those are the straws that I just got so maybe if later on I order the other ones I'll show you guys how they look but these are a good travel must have the second travel must have is actually a mini travel portable steamer i got this also in a little pink as you can see i like pink it's so cute it's so little it's not that big well my head is big so so but it's so good to travel because like your clothes look good i don't like those little irons from the hotels things like that all you have to do is just plug it in and you're good to go and it has only an on button when you put the water in and you turn it on it does take about five seconds at the most for it to get hot and start steaming so this is really really good to have it was only like twenty dollars and so yeah for this one I am happy like I already tried it so I love it and plus here in my apartment like I said I don't have a lot of room so little things like this for me are so perfect and it doesn't take a lot of room and I can store it away really good right now but yeah so this is the second thing second travel thing yeah but this is the little steamer like I said everything will be linked down below the third thing the third thing. oh no I forgot to show you one more thing for the restroom so I have these little racer holders that I bought it was only like four dollars at the most I think and it came with two so it came with this one and the one that I already have in the restroom and like I said later on, I'll show you how it works so you just put it in your wall wherever wall you decide to put it on the restroom I put it the farthest away like if the shower is this way I put it on that side and what I do instead of putting racers I actually put my phone right here to watch YouTube listen to music things like that it is dangerous but I like it because I just like watching YouTube and Netflix so I just put it right there and then I'll watch my show whatever I need to watch 
and it's cool. So I bought those and that was the last restaurant thing I think if I don't see anything later. Okay, the next thing I have is a travel I walk. It's called an iWalk and it's a portable charger for your phone. So all you gotta do is charge this little thing. It comes with a little charger and so you charge it before you leave and then when you need it you just Lift this thing up, and then let me grab my phone. Lift this thing up, and then you just put your iPhone on top, connect it, and that's it. And it starts charging your phone. It doesn't take too much space, so that's why I like this little thing. Plus, it's pink. But if it's really good in the, you know, in your little bags, things like this, it's not bulky or anything like that. Now I have seen like the uh, charging cases, things like that, but I don't like their cases because they're they tend to be a little too thick. And so I, I prefer this little thing that I can just put whenever I want and that's it. But it's so cute and I think it was super cheap too. I'll link it down below but it's so cute, it's so little and I love it. See, it's little. And it doesn't get on your way from like holding the phone or if you wanted to take pictures or videos, things like that. It's just perfect. Especially me, I have little hands in. I'm not complaining. So yeah, so this is the iWalk. And like I said, I'll link it down below. Perfect for travel. Especially me, because I like taking pictures and videos and I drain the heck out of my battery. So I always need to be carrying a portable charger with me, always. But yeah, so this is the iWalk. The next thing for travel. What is the next thing for travel? Okay. The next thing is this, oh no, it fell. Well, I took it out of the box. So the next thing I want to show you is this super cool thing. So this is a travel washing machine. And it's not that big, it's actually pretty a good size. It's like three inches thick and like a 13 inch or 12 inch like width, width, height, height, length. I don't even know how to say it. But it's like a 12 by 12 or 13 by 13. And it's so cool. So I saw it on TikTok. And all you do is take off the lid, which is like a leatherish material. And it's like cute, a pink color. And here's the washer. It comes with like, like a legit little washer. And so all you do is like push it. You grab the thing. And then you push down. And it'll open up like this. And it turns into this huge little container. And so all you do is just put soap in it, water, and the clothes that you're going to wash. And this is really good for traveling for like underwears or even swimsuits or pretty much every clothes. You just have to wash it like every day after you're done using them. And the reason why I like it is because when I travel out of the country, I tend to be out for two weeks and I hate coming home and having to wash everything and put it away. It's just a lot of work. So if I can just wash it while I'm over there already and just bring it home and hang it, that'd be the best thing ever. And this is good for like cruises, things like that. You don't have to pay to get your things washed. You can just wash it. And it's not bulky at all. Like you can definitely travel, especially for road trips or camping, things like that. Now I also got it for to use here because I have a lot of clothes that are very sensitive, very thin, things like that that I don't like putting like with the regular clothes. So I will wash it separately from that. That way they don't get damaged and they're taken care of. But yeah, I freaking love it. It was a little expensive. I think it was like $150, but I freaking love this thing. Like this is so cool. You guys can't tell me this is so cool. And this is not as big as those big ones that people are putting on TikTok. Um, you know, for like apartments or things like that. But I freaking love it. It's so cute. It's so easy to use and so like lightweight. Um, but it did take over a month to get to me. But it's okay because I didn't have no plans. So I freaking love this. This is going to be my favorite, favorite thing. And I can't wait to use it later on. Like I said, if I decide to try all these things for you guys, um, I'll post a video of how you use them and how it works and give you a little review on this one. Alright, so it looks like that's it for the restroom travel beauty. 
The next thing is kitchen. So I only have three things from the kitchen department. And the first thing is this little thing. And so what it does is it cuts and seals bags. So that means like if you have those big old bag chips and you're almost done with them, um, you just cut it so you don't have that extra little, you know, bag. So it has a little cutter right here. I don't know if you can tell. So you cut it and then on this side it has a sealer. So you just seal the bag, which, you know, you can, your, your food or your chips won't go stale. It will last longer because they're sealed. Um, but it's so cool. I'm so excited to keep using this. Uh, you know, TikTok, TikTok makes you buy so many things. Like all these things are brand new pretty much. I don't know. I have a problem with TikTok. And right now my Amazon list is like freaking full. I'll put a picture right here. That way you guys can see what I want to buy in my future. But this is the first thing I got for the kitchen. The second thing I got for the kitchen, and I already used this one so I approve, is a potato peeler. And the reason why is because if you know me, you know I freaking love patatas, potatoes. Any kind of potatoes I love, like potato chips, mashed potatoes, baked potatoes, potatoes, anything, I freaking love potatoes. And so, when I do breakfast, I hate peeling the potatoes. Like, I hate it, it takes too long, it's a mess. And so I went ahead and bought this one, and it's so cool. So all you do is just put it right here like this. And as soon as you press the little button, I think, it starts peeling automatically. And I'll have it done like in five seconds or three seconds. And it doesn't even make a mess. So I'll start collecting this little wire thingy all the way until it's like done. And then all you have to do is just pick it up and throw it in the trash, and that's it. So it's not messy at all. And it peels anything pretty much like squash, lemons, potatoes, pretty much everything, oranges, kiwis. And it's so freaking cool. I freaking love it. My husband already tried it and he loved it. So yeah, so if you have a chance and you like potatoes, I say buy this thing because it's so good. I freaking love this. And this is called the Potato Express. And I'll link it down below, but this is the best buy I've ever had so far. Yeah. For sure. Okay, the last thing I have from the kitchen, the kitchen department, is actually these cereal bowl containers, and I keep seeing this on Pinterest. And the, I'll put a picture right now. That way, you guys can see what picture I'm talking about. And I'm trying to organize my closet like that. Now, these don't fit right now here in my apartment, so I have them stored away because, like I said, they don't fit. And this is for my future home, not right, not for an apartment. And so it's so cute, it's white, it comes with two cereal containers, and I don't know, I just freaking love them, and I can't wait to put them on display. And I think this, these were like $50 for the two of them, which is not expensive at all, I think. But I will link it down below, and that way you guys, if you like it, you can go get them. And that was it. And that was the video for today. I do have a lot of brand new things that... I haven't even tried so if you want to see another video where I try all of these things for you guys um, give this video a big thumbs up and if you want me to do more of these kind of videos give this video a big thumbs up I do have a huge Amazon list that I want to get still and as soon as I do and buy those things I will make another video if you guys want to see it before you go don't forget to subscribe either down below or my picture will pop up somewhere right here. Click on it and subscribe. Turn on your post notification, the little bell. That will notify you when I post my next video. And until next time, bye.